Now to the high school ranks. Sergeant Bluff Luton was playing host to Sioux City West this afternoon. And so far this season, it's been a tough go for the Warriors versus the Sioux City schools. They're 1-3 and three versus North and East, but they're looking to improve that record against the Wolverines today. Good breeze out to right over at the SBL Complex for game one. Bottom of the fifth, tied at two. SBL takes the lead off of a fielding error. Spencer Clean made contact with the throw to first is bungled. Jacob Massey is going to score. That makes it 3 2 Warriors. Now on to the seventh runner on third. Brady Larson sends it up the gut, and that's going to tie this game up at three. Same inning. Colby Neiman puts the squeeze on. And that's going to score Larson from third. Wolverines take a 4 to 3 lead heading into the bottom of the seventh. Bottom seven, a pass ball with two men on, ties this game. Derek Fitzgerald is going to beat the tag home, and then a pair of intentional walks load the bases for Wade Fair, and Fair gets it done. A walk-off single. This ball game is over. SBL wins it five to four. We had zero outs, so kind of thought just like put something in place that we can win the game, and I mean came up with a single that went up the middle, so it worked out, I guess. Bishop Heelan was also in action. They were taking on C.B. Lincoln. The Lynx struck first in the third inning. Andrew Christensen ropes one down the third baseline. That's going to bring in a run for Lincoln, but they weren't finished in that inning. Ben Fitchter sends one into the gap. Christensen rounds third, and that's going to give the Lynx a two-run advantage. But then here come the Crusaders. Ben Dixon at the plate. He's going to send one over the shortstop's head. And that brings in the runner from second. Heelan cuts into the deficit. They tie it up a few, pit, a few pitches later on a wild pitch. And then Trent Hope at the plate. He sends one through for a base hit. Ben Dixon was on third. He comes in to score. Heelan would put up five runs in the third inning. They'd go on to win this ball game too. Six to four, the final. And now for some softball, it's West and SBL. Bottom of the first, Warriors come out swinging. That's Madeline Mogensen. Touch them all. That's a three-run shot to left. That makes it 3 nothing SBL. Still bottom of the first, no outs. Two on again. This time it's Kylie Kerr. She's going to shoot one into left. Kinsey Foley scores. That makes it a four-run game. And then the rally just continues. Freshman Addie Brown is going to get in on the action. Pops one up. And that is going to make it 6 nothing Warriors after the first Enning, bottom of the three, it's Mogensen again. This time, no home run. She's going to settle for an RBI single. It's going to push this lead seven zip, and SBL Mercy rules West 12 0 the final. 